Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play XCOM Terror from the Deep. When we last left off, we have been through almost the entire upper deck of this uh, ship and now we will try to finish the job. There are still some tests of around. Hypnotoad unfortunately has died from a fatal wound caused by friendly fire in the last turn. Marcus has shot him in the back under the alien control, I have to say. And he shot him in the back when, we ha when he had no weapon at all. Well, even that happens. So, Danny, go and have a look. I think there might be someone hiding in the kitchen. Now, somewhere over here must be Madeline, who will help both of you. Have a look. in the back as well and Alex will go and help as well. He can see Hop. Okay. Hop is not an alien. He is hostile under the alien control but he is definitely not an alien. So don't kill him please. That's fine, we can stay there. Azura. What about having a look from the other side? Shanti, just stay here. Marcus, stay, Faye, stay. RPE, have a look around the corner. There is a Flying saucer again. I really don't like these guys. 28. Go back. Okay. Mac. Anybody inside playing captain? Yes, there actually is one cheeky flying saucer in here. Do you have a stun rod? Yes, you have. Maybe we'll be able to take him alive. Who knows? Let's see. Nothing happened. Hop has dropped his weapon. And Azura doesn't see anything in here. That's good. That's good. Have a look over there as well. Now, Danny, where are you? You will continue scouting and exploring the kitchen over here. Seems okay, but uh, that's not always true. Nothing there. Alex, go and help them. Faye, pick up your weapon. Leave the grenade on the floor. And maybe you can even take a few clips. We'll need those later. Camille. You'll go up. Ooh, you can see. Wow. A flying saucer again. Good hit. Not so much for the other one. However, our 
good soldier RPE will try to finish what you have started. No line of fire. I almost don't believe you, but uh, if you say so. Come on, hit him already. This is not happening. Okay. Do I want to go inside? Yes, I do. Because I know that you are able to withstand that hit and you will take him alive. Stun. <laughs> that did not work. But I know for a fact that these guys have also a melee attack. And I know for a fact that uh, because of the bug in the game, he will not hurt me when I stand just next to him. So Mag is pretty safe there. Camille, move into safety as well. And let's end the turn. This is getting old. Marcus and Hope are under alien control. This is the melee, melee attack I was talking about. He was never in any danger. And now we will definitely try to take that alien alive. The game is quite slow. I guess it has to do with the size of this map and the number of aliens and other things. Come on, stun him already. Really? How many hits does it take to take him out? Maybe a lot. I usually don't do that. Okay, Camille. Take an aimed shot this time. That worked. However, you have no ammunition anymore. So you will reload. Excellent. Okay. There must be some Tassov left somewhere because there is still someone trying to use molecular control on me and I don't think it's the flying saucers. Who can you see? You can see whoever that is. Um, don't kill him, it's our guy. He just doesn't know it. Okay. There he is. Okay. You know what will happen to you, don't you? Alex, stay there. Madeline as well. Okay, RPE. Go over there. Check the rest of this uh, deck. You may need to go all the way here. Yeah. Tassov has panicked. But there are still some other aliens trying to take control of us. Like this one. Is this ever going to end? So... Ah, that was Marcus. Okay. Marcus, welcome back. Hide in here. Okay. Kriegel. Can you have a look over here first? Looks okay. And it's not okay. 
and we can't move. <laughs> wow, that's really bad. Let's hope he doesn't have a weapon. This one does, however. Um, was that a hit or not? That was definitely hit now. Okay, Alex, it's safe for you to go forward and help your colleagues. Merlin will do the same. Guard this corner. Azura, go inside, have a look. Is there anything unexplored? Yes, there is this room. Marcus is going there. And this room. Danny will go there right now. And the rest looks fine. There are two black spots over here. Guess that's fine. So, the lowest deck was fully explored. The deck above as well. The third deck and the fourth deck have been explored too. Okay. There are not so many aliens left, I can tell you that. This one. And finally we will find out if we will able to move there. How come we are not able to move there and that guy was? Ah, okay. Mag, go and have a look over there. Nothing. RP, can you see any aliens? No, you can't. Okay, that's not bad. Not bad at all. Camille. Oh, Kriegel. Yeah. Good luck, Kriegel. You'll need it now. Tassov has gone berserk. Excellent. And no mind control. That means this guy is most probably the last one. And we'll kill him right now. Take his ammo. And because this is most probably the last alien, we will try to pick up some ammunition from this guy. Uh, wow, we will definitely pick this. That's worth 300,000 or so. Pick up the ammo if you can. Excellent. Um, you can't pick up anything. Marcus, have a look inside. Nothing to pick up here. Here either. Comfey, take this with you. You can't use it anyway. And... Uh, yeah, I think that's it. Yeah, that must be it. So, big surprise, what happens now? Well, there is still an alien somewhere. You know what? This is ridiculous. Where are you aliens? Oh, and uh, there was no mind control, right? So, the last remaining alien is a flying saucer. So, he can be anywhere, basically, because they can fly. They can... Uh, they can do whatever they like. And this is the really boring part, so... I guess, I guess I will save now and uh, try to look for that alien and uh, come back when I finally find him. Because I don't want to spend another 20 minutes looking for him just doing nothing. So 
I will save as part 36. And we'll start searching for the alien now. Until then, I will pause the recording, so please stay tuned and I will be back in a second. And we are back. It didn't take long, just uh, two turns or so. And RP has found hopefully the last alien hiding over here. And he took a hit when he tried to go around the corner, so he now lost a little bit of his health. However, he did not suffer any fatal wounds. So we'll do the same trick as before. Go right there so that he doesn't shoot at us anymore. Instead, he will use uh, the... Oh, he can shoot from here as well. I thought he would be using the melee attack. Maybe that's the case only when uh, when we are not shooting at him. And what he just did was a reaction fire, maybe. Let's test that, because I really am quite sure he can't attack, or at least shoot, when so close to us. And I was wrong again. This game never stops to surprise me. Fortunately, RP did not have to pay with his life for that. For my mistake. Do we want to stun him or do we want to kill him? I don't know how much damage does the blast do. So we'll try to take him alive. Yeah, that worked nicely. Let's finally have a look at his name. It's called a Biodrone. Well, Biodrone. Nice to meet you. Are you the last alien in this part of the mission? Yes, you are. Ship Rescue Mission. Now the upper deck is clear, proceed to the lower decks. Using the cargo lift, you descend into the hold. Your squad must eliminate all aliens on this level to complete the mission. To abort, place all aquanauts on the lift, start point, and click on abort mission icon. We will definitely not do that. We have made it so far, so we better win. Fish food. You don't need any weapons, you are anyway just a puppet. Hop, the same. RP is good. That's fine. You have uh, two rounds left, so use this ammo, I guess. Azura. You have enough ammo. Shanti. Nine. Okay. Take the other clip and We'll even give this one to someone. Ten. Mag. Nine. That's not enough. Let's take more. From here. Merlin. Six rounds. Let's give you twelve instead. Um, Alex. You have thirteen. That's fine. Kriegel. 13, that's okay as well. You know what? How can we do that? This one has only 6, okay. So we can keep this here and this there. Camille, 15, that's okay. Marcus, 4, that's not okay. You'll get... 15 as well. Danny, keep, keep this in your backpack. Uh, you will give this to someone else. Faye can leave that lying on the ground. Actually, take it. You are not a heavy soldier. You can train 
your strength using this. Fish food will definitely be controlled by aliens and hop. I'm not sure if I want to give you a weapon. I'm really not sure. But Azura will make a better use of it, I guess. Okay, so um, it's been 20 minutes again. Well, let's start this uh, second part and we start over here. We can see only very small part of the map. There are four levels again. And uh, this one hopefully will not take as long as the previous upper deck. I guess we can make it in, I'd say, two episodes or so. But that will have to wait. Because now we are going to save as part 36. And when we come back, we'll see what the aliens have prepared for us on the lower deck of this ship. Until then, bye bye.